Chat GPT is a chatbot that uses natural language processing techniques and machine learning algorithms to generate responses to user input. As we all know by now, Chat GPT has taken the entire world by storm. There are multiple use cases where people have started creating business solutions out of Chat GPT's output. But there is one website on the internet which has blocked Chat GPT, and that website is Stack Overflow. Stack Overflow is a question and answer platform for programming and development topics. And given that there are policies in place to ensure that the content on the site is appropriate and relevant, Stack Overflow has currently banned all the responses which people are pasting through ChatGPT. Given that there are some amount of concerns that people are raising with respect to ChatGPT's output, wouldn't it be great if you could actually verify whether a given piece of text is generated through ChatGPT? So in the coming part of the video, I'll show you how you can check if your output is basically generated from ChatGPT or not. So without wasting any further time, let's kickstart the video. As you can clearly see on the screen, since I was recording the audio, I also decided to create some chat outputs from ChatGPT. The first question that I asked ChatGPT was, give me an example stating not to reinvent the wheel. So that was the first question that I asked and I got a good response out of it. I was not really happy. I wanted like a live example for it, which is where I asked the second question, which is give me a live example for it. Then I went forward and asked for more examples for it, which is where you have more responses coming up. Let me also ask about what GPT-3 is. So I asked, tell me something about GPT-3. And here is the output that I'm seeing right now on the screen. So these are the texts that are generated through chat GPT. Now I want to verify if these set of text messages are generated through chat GPT or not, which is where now I have to validate the output of the response that is coming out as well. So there is an amazing website wherein Hugging Face has kind of open sourced a GPT-2 detector, uh, which basically detects all the chat that is generated through GPT-2 model. This currently seems to be working fine for GPT-3.5 model as well. So let me go forward and paste some text here. So let me paste the last output that I generated, which is GPT-3. And, and finally, it says that the entire text that is generated is fake. Now I've just written a small sentence that is, my name is Bhavesh Bhatt and I create videos on data science and machine learning. And the detector tells me that it is 83% real and 17% fake. So it's able to detect actual text that I have typed in. Now let me go forward and paste the reinventing example that I had just shown you. So let me paste it here. And now it says that the output is 96% fake. So let me paste one more example of the same category, which is reinventing the wheel. And here again, it says that it's basically fake. So in general, the GPT-2 output detector is doing a fabulous job in terms of detecting whether a given set of text has been generated by the language model. If it's detected by the language model, then it will flag it off and state that it is basically a fake text that is generated by a machine. So uh, a very handy tool. Uh, I'll add the link to the tool in the description section of the video. Feel free to check it out. So if you have to ever validate if you receive an email or if you receive some kind of a text and if you want to validate if a given output is basically if it's real text or not which is where this particular website would definitely come in handy. So this is something that I wanted to share with all of you today so that you are aware of what output you are consuming, whether it is actual human generated or whether it is chat GPT generated. I hope you enjoyed the video today. Do subscribe to my channel for future amazing videos on data science and machine learning. Thank you so much for watching the video.